What is up guys, Zach Scott here, playing Plants vs. Zombies Heroes, and today I'm going to show you the strategy decks of uh, Super Brains. So, uh, are you guys ready to see that? His name is indeed Super Brains. Sometimes I get it, I get it wrong, <laughs> but his name is Super Brains. And uh, so we're going to look at his strategy decks really quick to see what we need to do uh, to hopefully pull off a uh, some victories here. Um, he has, if we click on him... Uh, he has Hit Home, Plundering Pilots, and PhD in Zombie. <laughs> Hit Home is kind of about the imps and toxic stuff. Uh, plant Heroes Beware. This fast strategy deck puts anti-hero zombies like Mini Ninja, Stealthy Imp, and Walrus Rider into position to hit hard thanks to a little help from tricks like Smoke Bomb and Backyard Bounce. So the premise behind this is to move them, move them around, uh, maybe have this guy bounce them, or just indeed do the bounce right here. Uh, that way we'll be able to um, we'll be able to keep the lanes clear and then deal some severe damage. We'll see how it works though. Uh, what I like about this deck right off the bat is looking at it is that they have a couple strike throughs as well. So the strike throughs should help balance it out. But overall, it's kind of a lot like some of the imp decks that I played uh, before. We have a lot of uh, you know toxic waste imps in here. We have three of them. Uh, so the imps are going to be toxic. So I played very similar decks before and maybe this one's more balanced than any one that I've made. Plundering pirates is kind of interesting. Ahoy matey, send a crew of pirates ashore to plague the plants until they walk the Zombot Plank Walker. Imp commander, toxic waste imp, and a passel of swabbies add impish fun to the fight. So yeah, we still have the toxic stuff going on here. Um, I assume that's going to be in pretty much any good Super Brains deck, the toxic aspect. But we do have some pirates to draw some cards. Uh, we can play them as tricks. Um, we also have this ultimately, which is uh, when played, make two other random pirates in random lanes. It's just going to be and, and that's a strike through element for that too. Um, okay, so last but not least, PhD in Zombie. Um, I haven't fully grasped this one, but it's a scientific fact that science zombies work well together. Want proof? Put portal technician, Zombot, Zombot drone engineer, and gadget scientist in the fight together and watch the plant foe fall. We'll see how that works. Um, all the science zombies working together sounds interesting. We also have the science pet zombie. When a plant gets hurt, destroy it. When any plant is destroyed, this gets plus one. Uh, so we're going to see what kind of stuff we can... We can um, I mean, each science zombie does a bonus attack. Holy cow, imagine having this out and that doing a bonus attack. So uh, it's going to be a really interesting deck. We do have this guy in here. Uh, when a gravestone zombie is revealed, that zombie gets plus one, plus one. Uh, we have a lot of gravestone zombies, especially initially, so uh, maybe we'll see how that works. That's uh, you know a, a type of um, strategy that I don't use that often. So we're gonna bring these decks into ranked multiplayer. We're gonna see how it works. Uh, I need only one more victory to level up, and then I'll be kind of smooth sailing uh, a little bit. But who knows? Maybe I'll maybe I'll lose this first one. Who knows? Uh, my point is to try to um, try to get try to test these decks out. Uh, with my playing style and see what works. Uh, I won all three that I did with the um, the, peach, the green shadow last time. I don't know if I will this time, but we'll see how Hit Home uh, pulls through. Again, I don't know how it's gonna work. We got someone not dead ace. Lower rank, but don't let that fool you. He could be great, she could be great. Uh, that's a lot of moving. That looks just about perfect as a, of a start. Uh, let's see what happens. Rose is going to be able to uh, transmogrify any of my heavy hitters. But this one's also cool because this is move a zombie, then does a bonus attack. So I'm going to wait. I'm not going to play unless I can move. Um, okay, never mind. So there we go. She might freeze me next turn. Darn it. Oh, well, that's fine. This is uh, do... Uh, okay, one damage when it enters the lane there. I'm going to go ahead and play this. I wonder how tricksy I can really be. Let's play this. I'm gonna move it if I need to. Darn it, freeze a zombie. Anti-hero three. Um, all right, so she froze it. I can move and then do a bonus attack. And then he'll be able to attack right now. Move a zombie, it does a bonus attack. So yeah, we're gonna move it, it's gonna do the bonus attack, it's going to uh, basically resolve. Then I'll be able to actually attack for four. I got hit for three. This is gonna be a tough one, huh? Um, Gravestone and deadly, so let's go ahead and make that dead. Yeah, block that for sure. 
I don't know. Darn it. Darn it. That kills it. That's fine. All right, hello, it's me. Deadly, though. All right, let's see what happens with this. Now, I I do admit that a lot of cool things can happen. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead, this one's, uh, you know, when revealed, move the zombie. Let's go ahead and play this. That way, if I need to do a bonus attack, I can. Or I can just move, and then move a zombie gets plus one. Ooh, yikes. Let's see. Uh, okay. Let me think about this. If he's gonna die anyway, this is move him, he gets plus one for attack. He's gonna die anyway. I can't move him out of the way, unfortunately. This is slash damage of three. So yeah, gonna move him, he's, he's gonna do three. That'll help block it out. There we go. Oh, I like the animation on that. I hadn't seen that before. That's cool. All right. I still have the move. I can move and do a bonus attack, which is really cool. Let's see what... Oh, I can't now. Um, let's see. Oof. Oof. Choose where to move the zombie. Okay, we're going to move over here. Uh, I'm going to move this guy. Um, and he gets plus one all the way over here. So that we can uh, destroy that flower. This is an interesting deck. Good lord. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're going to see what happens. Ah, darn. Uh, yeah, that strike through is alarming, isn't it? Um... Okay, we'll, we'll stick with this. Here we go. She's probably going to block this. It's 9 to 8. Yikes. All right. I don't know what to think. Um... All right, let's see how this goes. I'm gonna be able to take out, darn it. I'm gonna freeze him. Ugh, that's annoying. Dang it. I'm gonna have to do the bonus attack there, I think. They put, she played that in the wrong order, what the heck. Boom. Interesting. Um, yeah, I'm, so I'm gonna have to, which would I rather do now? Probably this, a zombie does a bonus attack, so hit him. Goodness, I don't know how I like this. I'm should, I, I would hope to block either this one or the next one. Nope. One more hit, oh, thankfully I blocked. Oh, I can't even use that yet. Oh my goodness, this is a close match. Believe you me, this is a close match. Uh, this is destroy a zombie that's five or more. Crazy. Um, I can't block that four, so I might as well do this. Block that, maybe, I don't know. Darn it. Well, that three's still gonna hit. Dang it. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Oh man, darn it, I'm dead. That didn't quite work out for me. Yeah, wow, I don't know if I can, I mean, I don't know, Let's let's play again with this deck. I thought I did the best I could do, uh, but those strike throughs were really messing with me and she kept freezing me, so I lost a star. That's okay. Well, let's see what I can do. I'll try again, I'll go again. Like I said, don't let the player's level be deceiving. Let's do a hit home again, see if I can be victorious. I'm going against someone about my level this time. This green shadow, gotta watch out for that middle. Um, yeah. Pricey, huh? It's a little bit better. All right. This is all zombies have toxic. I can't play this turn. Green Shadow might be able to. Five in the middle, that's fine. 
Yep, not gonna do anything for me this time. Uh, let's see what kind of card I get. Okay. I don't know what other choice I really have. So I'm gonna play this, maybe do two damage, maybe she'll block it. I don't know. I'm already at a big disadvantage. I took five damage already. Yeah, darn. If I get that fire chicken, that would be great. Um, I don't know what to do. Um, when revealed, move the zombie. We'll see. I might move her over to the uh, to the black-eyed pea there. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to move her. Oh, jeez, come on. Oh, jeez. Really? Okay. Fine. We'll do that. I'm gonna get hit for four. Goodness, okay. Well, let's try that again, shall we? Uh, and then... Uh, Sure, here we go. Let's see what happens here. I'm treating the strike throughs kind of like, uh... Okay, freeze the zombie. Oh, it's gonna be him, of course. Darn. Uh, okay. I don't know if this is like a freeze deck or what I'm looking at. It's so weird to see a snow pee uh, behind, a, behind a torch wood. I think any sort of freeze effect should be canceled out. But I don't know. I don't have any extra brains, so just move it here. So cancel that lane out. Should be fine. All right. All right, 12 to 11. Yeah, this is tough stuff, you know. Let's see how this plays out. I don't know. Could hit him for six. She could block that one, to be honest. All right. Six is half her health. I'm playing like the best cards I can each turn and that might be my my downfall. I might need to hold on to some stuff or try to do some combos with tricks, you know, but who knows. She can also block that, by the way. I think we each have a chance of blocking the next hit. I'm just curious to see what she does. Don't tell me she disconnected. It's possible that she doesn't like her cards. Or maybe just had a genuine network connection issue. Let's see. Okay, wow. Wow. Okay, I, I thought I controlled their strategies pretty well. Uh, I want like a for real win though. I don't know, I mean, if I'll get it, but I do want a for real win. How did I play three dancing? Did I play three dancing zombies and not realize it? Okay. I want to try one more time with this deck. Win or lose, I'll move on to the next deck. Because uh, we're, we're kind of seeing the strategies that are playing out. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, those are both pretty pricey. That's all right. Let's rock with this and see where this goes. And I got one of those too, which is pretty cool because it moves and does a bonus attack. All right, where are we going with this? Ah, man, I don't have anything to play there. I'm gonna take three damage, that's okay. Next up, um, I pretty much have to play the chicken here. That'll do one damage to it, which is good. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's fine. All right, let's see this play out, please. I'm gonna start here. And see where we end up. Let's 
gets really interesting, I might go ahead and... No, we're fine. Let's stick with that. Two damage, 17 to 18. All right, we got some options. Uh, what I like about this is this has Gravestone. I can move it though and have it do a bonus attack, which would be amazing. Do three, duh, come on. All right. I'm good. Attack for six. Man, I, this, this Spadal might get overwhelmed depending on what happens. Because I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna do this. Oh jeez, I'm a little nervous for Spadow here. I can move all of, I can move two of them next, you know, during the tricks phase. Dang it! That's a shame. All right, so uh, yikes. What I'm gonna do now is do the bonus attack. There we go. Excellent. Blocked. 17 to six. I feel like I'm on top, but I know that there's a lot of stuff going on that may not work. I'm gonna have to move that during tricks phase, if, if I can. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to move it during tricks phase. All right, let's see what happens. I can move any of these. I don't know what to do. I mean, I win if nothing happens at this point, because I'll hit him with the four, then the two. So if the Spadow plays, I don't know what Spadow's gonna do. Okay, yeah, that's what I would do too. All right, so here's the uh, here's the interesting thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna move. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna move. Uh, this is wonderful. Uh, I'm gonna move this, and this is gonna do a bonus attack. It might be my immediate victory. Victory. All right. Excellent. That was a quick victory, and I like that. And I level up too. All right, so now I'm kind of in the relaxed zone where uh, it doesn't really matter what happens because I'm in uh, level 28. And, uh, you know, if I can't go further down, which is wonderful. So uh, I really like the level up system. If they ever make it so that you can drop level, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> uh, so anyway, yeah, cool. That was a good deck, uh, I thought. I mean, at least I played it well, I thought. Plundering Pirates is next. Again, this is the one where we have pirates, but we also have the imp stuff going on, so it's not too strangely different. But I'm gonna try to play with that. If I like lose a couple, like if I lose two in a row, I'll just move on to the next deck. That's kind of what I'm gonna do. If I win one, I'll move on. If I lose two in a row, I'll move on. That is too pricey right now. Jeez, I'll stick with it, I guess. I don't know what to think about this guy though. I don't know, let's rock, here we go. What should I do? This is cool because I get to play a play a trick and draw a card. Uh, you know, I can play it, but I don't know if I want to. Let's do it. One one on heights. Let's see how the P reacts. I maybe should have done it as a trick next turn, but I don't know. Interesting. All right. One. All right. Yeah, I can't play this turn. Unless it's to give him deadly, which I might do, honestly. Yeah, I don't know. He's stronger now. Ugh. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, I don't know. Let me just play it. I don't know. I'm desperate. I don't know why I'm suddenly desperate. Okay. Nope. <laughs> I'm not used to that strategy of just dropping them out there, so I don't know what I'm going to do right now. I'm probably going to do this, honestly. Gravestone Deadly. That's about as good as it gets for me. 
And I wouldn't have had that had I not done the done the, the draw thing, so I'm really happy about the way that this has gone. Oh my god. Alright. Yep, okay. <laughs> Alright, and then I'll probably bounce the guy next, honestly. I'll probably bounce that flower. Yeah, that guy's really strong. But you're not gonna know what's behind the gravestone. Doesn't matter, you're dead. Here we go. Meanwhile, I've been taking like three damage each turn, so there is a, some part of this that's tough. Um, it's four, so I'm gonna have to play. Uh, well, I could do a couple of things. Um, I don't have a lot of imps. I'm bouncing it. Maybe she'll play some more ice, get them frozen, it won't know what hit, boom, bounce. Who knows? I don't know what to do. Yep. Okay, good. This is fun. Beeped him up. He's gone. Bounced. Bounce. Get out of here. Then we cancel each other out. All right, great. God. <laughs> This is something, right? Well, I'm gonna try to uh, do two things. Okay, two imps are out. I'm avoiding that middle lane. Ooh, interesting. And that counts as a P, which is annoying. I, I just learned that from the comments. But that counts as a P. I'm gonna take six damage. I might block it. He's gonna take seven. Blocked, never mind. What, five in the middle lane? Come on. <laughs> no. Alright. Wow. Six in the middle lane. Okay. Please block this, and that'll be a miracle. No. I blocked a two, okay. Draw two cards, please do. Goodness gracious, uh, I know that was a trick, that's okay. Seven to 14, which is definitely, definitely brutal here, but we'll see what happens. Uh, the one thing I could think to do right now is to play this guy, this guy is what? When this hurts the plant hero, this pirate gets plus one, plus one, he's just a pirate though. We're talking Imp Swabby's next door. Let's go with it, let's see what happens. It's deadly. I have a lot of cards. I don't know what the P can do. Bonus attacks, of course. Oh geez, a bonus attack would ruin to me. What else can I do? Okay, freeze a zombie, who's it gonna be? Of course. Well, you know, I can also, um, yeah, make all the zombies deadly just so that if anything happens, okay, great. Then move a zombie. It gets plus one. Nope, can't move a zombie. We're fine. Dead. Dead. He's dead, but he makes his imp which, uh, next to him, which is great, which makes him dead. He's an imp, so he's toxic now. Wonderful. And there's two, it's seven to ten, and I've been getting so many cards that it's ridiculous. Ugh. All right, so here's kind of what I want to do. Uh, I'm scared, okay. I'm scared that guy will be destroyed. If he's not destroyed, I'm gonna move someone over to him. No, that costs three. Darn, uh. All right, I'm saving a trick to move one of them over to him. Cause I can't, I, I'm leaving that open. I know that she can attack with the five in the middle, so I don't know what I wanna do. I know that's a possibility for her. So basically what I'm doing is I'm leaving it open. Okay, those beans are gonna be crazy. Okay. Okay. So I definitely have to do this now. I'm moving this guy. Over there. He gets more tricks, but he's gone. Here we go. 
There we go. He's dead, by the way. I make two imps to the side. They're both toxic for the moment. He's gone. He's gone. And I do two damage. Oh my god. Okay. What the heck do I do here? Uh, this guy... When this hurts the plants, you know your life is over. Um... Alright, let's see what happens. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't have any tricks to leverage, so I don't know. I can't win with the six, so I, I didn't play it. Bounce a zombie. Okay, that makes sense. But what I'm really worried about is that it's just gonna... Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Good job, pea shooter. Or uh, green shot. That was great. Saving up for that one. That was good. Unfortunately, I didn't have any moves. I already used my move before. I expected to be, for, you know... I don't think I could have played better. I did like exactly what I thought because uh, what happened is uh, you, you saw the middle row there. Like I knew that if I put something there, she could either strike it down with the five or bounce it or any number of things. So what I did is I snuck in, I moved, I destroyed it, but came back at me, got me good uh, with that. So we're gonna try this deck again. I want like a real victory with it. If I don't get it this time, we'll just move on. Uh, we're just showcasing the decks, not necessarily winning with each deck, so. Uh, this looks really good, but let's cycle out the fours. This looks okay. I don't think I have any ones. This is all about the pirates and working together and thinking about that, and I'm trying to think about it, but I, I don't know. Let's see what we need to do. Yep, that's tough. All right, skip. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're fine, though. Yep. We'll take the two damage, I guess. Slow start here. Alright, we're each dealing two. Great. Alright. Well, you know what I'm doing. I have like several of these guys. Hopefully he doesn't have a gravestone, a grave buster. Okay, that's expected. All right. Wonderful. This is cool because it destroys the plant that's five or more. I wish I would have had it last round. Mm. All right, here we go. Let's see what happens here. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, I don't have anything else to do, so I'm gonna get two draw a card. The, the drawing cards thing is great. It allows me to have a lot of options. Yeah, I don't know what I want to do. Um, I guess I want to play these guys, maybe. I don't know what I want to do. Let's play something that's a trick, maybe. Maybe I can play uh, this guy's a trick. attack. No, I don't. Oh, why did I do that? God. Okay, I'm a fool. Okay, I forgot this comes up as a gravestone. But it does block him. That's kind of cool. He's now back to a 2-1. Uh, I can now play this and uh... Oh, God, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. 
I do have the, the now destroy a plant that's five or more in case he gets boosted up. He'll four draw a card, okay. But if he gets boosted, if he plays a plant, then he'll be even strong. I don't know, we'll see. There we go, that's what we're talking about. Destroy a plant that has five or more. Goodbye. And I do maybe three damage. Dead, this guy's dead too, by the way. He heals a little bit though, but he's still alive. Holy goodness, okay. Uh, I don't know what's gonna be here, but the, this definitely seems like the best option for the moment. Uh, unless I can just wipe someone out. Here we go. What do you think? I can do this and then do a bonus attack. This is great. This is great. The bonus attack is going to be amazing. Uh, depending on who it is. Depending on what he does. Because I have two deadlies and the bonus attack will work great with those. Um, and then if you play something in the far left or far right. That's a little annoying. Okay. I'm fine with that. Do the bonus attack for this guy then. What do you think about that? He's not going to block it, so that's wonderful. I'm going to do two damage to him that's unblocked. I forgot all about whatever his ability is. Oh, it drains the block meter. Oh my god, I forgot that he does that. Oh my god, I totally forgot he, did, he drains the block meter. Whoa. -ho. Drains it again. Just keep on draining that block meter. Wow. I totally forgot about that. I'm not even lying. Um, yeah, we're going to bounce something. I don't know what, but we're going to bounce something. I'm going to probably bounce him, honestly. Okay, that's fine. It destroys it, right? My turn, bounce you. You're gone. Oh my god, I won. All right. Well, we're going to move on to the next deck now. This is really cool. Ten for two. Boom. Five dead. Wow. That's cool. Um, I totally forgot to empty the block meter. I should have used that earlier. Um, but yeah. Wow. Got one star. No. <laughs> Anyway, so let's move on to the next deck that we now that we've won a full full game with that. Thank you for not conceding. Uh, I mean, you can concede. Thank you for not disconnecting. I guess is what I should say. Uh, the next one, a PhD in Zombie. Uh, let's look over it one more time. Uh, you know, we're gonna deal with the gravestone guys giving power to everyone. Maybe I should shuffle for it. I don't know. Um, but you know, we have this guy. If I have him, he gets cheaper each time. So keep him. Don't mulligan him. I guess. Lots of legendaries in this. This is just going to be an insane deck. We'll see how it goes. There's definitely a, um, you know, a science zombie mechanic going on that I'm going to need to leverage. Uh, or I would probably prove useful to leverage. We'll see how it goes, though. This is fun using these strategy decks because I feel like I, did, I didn't invest a lot into this. You know, like, I didn't, like, make this deck myself. So I don't feel ashamed too much if I lose. If I lose, it's just based on my skill, not necessarily my intellect, too. <laughs> is that a good way to think about it? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's cycle that out. Goodness. Let's cycle that out. Goodness. Everything's expensive. Oh, my God. Yeah, maybe I shuffled wrong. Maybe should have stuck with it. Next round, I'll play something. Green Shadows here. Is this a... Uh, grave? It's a Gravestone. I can play him in the middle. I don't know. You know what, if she wanted to do damage in the middle, she would have done it already. I wonder if there's anything that costs one that goes great that, that, that is a gravestone. And that I wonder. Let's see what the green shadow does. Nothing, that's weird. Alright. Ah. Well, it's another gravestone, huh? 
Should have put him over to the, the to the right, I guess. Oh well. It's gonna be Trixie. Freeze already. Weird. That's really weird. Okay. Okay. I understand that, but I also understand that it doesn't really matter because it's only gonna do two damage to me. And that becomes a two three, and I draw a card, which is wonderful. This is uh, when we build a plant as a bonus attack. This is uh, great when you play your first trick. I'm not gonna play a trick. So I'm gonna probably do this and then give everyone. Yeah. Okay. There we go. We'll see what happens. I don't know. Darn it. Oh wait, no. I'll have him do the bonus. Uh, darn it. That's terrible. Um. Reveal the plant as a bonus attack. Who's it gonna be? Probably gonna be you. That makes sense to me. Because I get an extra card. Who knows what it is? Darn it, it's three, but all zombies get deadly. There we go. And I draw a card, by the way. So you're gone. The snow pea isn't gone, but he might as well be. <laughs> well, I mean, you know what I mean. Alright, nice. I have a lot of cards. Still go. Five. Okay, so this is interesting. When we build this, a zombie does a bonus attack. Okay. Um, but if I play that, when play the zombie does a bonus attack, which would be great for him. Oh, he blocked. Nice. Just clearing the field, you know. All right. I have a lot of those guys. Ooh. Okay. All right. Six. I mean... What do you think? Sure, I'm a little nervous about it, but let's see what happens. When a plant gets hurt, destroy it. I love that. Yikes. Ugh. That's definitely something to worry about. This is a destroy plant that's four or more. He's almost there. <laughs> He's gone next turn because I, I still have a scientist, which wouldn't play these science zombie as a bonus attack. Oh my god. Next turn I'll be able to play that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you moving? Oh great. Okay. You know what? Fine. Hmm. That's something. Um, this is destroy a plant as four or more. I can't play anything more expensive than four. Okay. All right, let's see this happen. This is uh, destroy a plant that's four or more, unless she has a brain nana. Oh my god, I'll freak out if she has a brain nana. Cause I wasn't thinking about that. <laughs> All right. No oh, thank, thank God. Okay. Okay, that's fine. You're doing the. Uh, okay. So I'm going to destroy this plant. Of course. I'll get an extra extra thing as well, an extra trick. I have a lot of cards, my friends. This is a zombie gets plus, all zombies get plus two, plus two. So he attacks, he's dead, he gets hurt. All right, we got it. Good Lord, okay. So, um.
This, uh, the two, three space cadet. I don't know where he's gonna go yet. Move a zombie, of course. Keeps moving these guys around. Holy goodness. Wow. Wow. Very, very bold. Very bold move. Okay. Another trick. Next turn, I'll use it on you in the middle. I'll use it on someone. This is terrible. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Alright, well, I definitely need to block those two. This is, uh, each science zombie does a bonus attack. I'll block him. And then I'll do this. Okay, let's see what happens. I still have this three. Destroy a plant that has four or more. And I also still have, uh, this beam me up thing. This is a quite the battle, to be honest, but I have a lot of choices. This guy's rank 30. Oh boy, let's see what happens. Okay. Fair enough. You do the bonus attack. I get a card. So this is uh, destroy a plane that's four or more, which would be you. We know. Boom. All right, this he's gonna block this one. You might do five in the middle, which will get rid of me. So I maybe should have done it in the middle, but oh well. Either way, I really should have thought of that aspect. All right. Good lord, okay. Do I have any gravestones to play each? All right. Still have room for this trick zombie a two three. This is crazy. Oh dang it! Here it is. The five damage. I hope I block. What? Forget that. You know what? I would have blocked the next one. What am I doing? Okay. I don't get a card for that. I do get a card for that. Great. All right. My God. Okay. Okay. So this is interesting. That's great. He's dead. He attacks too. He blocked. Gosh. All right. This is crazy. This is a crazy round. I don't know what she has planned. All right. Bounce a random zombie. Do it. It's you. Which is great because... Uh, well, I don't know what she has planned. What if she has like the zucchini thing or something? Something real crazy, like I had to deal with before. This is a good battle though, but I'm gonna block the next hit. So, if it's a zucchini, she's gonna have to play it in the middle. Mm. 
Interesting. Okay. Okay. Blacked. Hit for one. Here's six. Well, this is my turn time to shine. Because I get to do a bonus attack with my shark. And that's a victory right there, guys. Victory! I beat someone higher level than me. Oh, man. That deck's pretty cool. It's a pretty good deck. I'll tell you that. Earn one star. Probably got a bonus as well. Oh, my gosh. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, I had a lot of fun playing with those three decks. Uh, with Super Brains. Come back next time for more. Maybe we'll show off another strategy deck. Or we'll see what the next event card is. I think the next event card is the electric blueberry so it, it may not be anyway you'll we'll see what what next time brings thanks for watching goodbye i'm zach scott subscribe if you have not if you like this video and want to help this channel grow all you got to do is click the like button below thanks so much for watching follow me on facebook twitter and instagram this is otto egon and i'll see you next time for more